Yeah, aliens suck. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs>50 feet behind each other. Yeah. And they'd stir up. And they all had stuff, you know, filters on their face. Yeah. So they didn't have to breathe it. Jeez, I tell you. And we had, what, three or four of them come in and park over there and just sit there for a while. Yeah. Like they were watching us, you know, getting ready to plan their invasion. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. They didn't know what we had cooking for them, did they? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, uh, you know, I've been having this trouble with my knee. It keeps swelling up, and uh, it go away. And I think, okay, so if, you know, we'll we'll go out. And well, long story short, Alan finally talked me into going back in town to get it fixed this time. So, uh, the what, what's this bone doctor, whatever they call them, they're wanting to do some uh, six weeks of physical therapy and then uh, I guess he's got some other stuff he wants to get done and then probably have to go get a new knee so I'm probably not going to be back out for the rest of the summer we planned on going to Utah and Wyoming but that's not going to happen so I got too hot <laughs> yeah yeah and the further north we went the hotter it got so right. I don't know well John you know like I said last night you know, you, you just got to take care of yourself because it's, it may get better for a little while. Get it, Isis. <laughs> <laughs> you got to take care of you, yourself because it may get better for a little while, but it's not going to last. Yeah. Come on. Yes. Yeah. I almost convinced myself that it's the way I'm sleeping to get the knee twisted or something. I don't know. But, uh, that's, you know, still, there's something wrong, so I'm going to have to go take care of it. So. Yeah. Maybe we kind of touched a little bit about going up there in uh, early spring next year, up that way, so. Or maybe even late fall, we'll see. Yeah. But lots of snow and lots of mountains. He wanted, I wanted to go see Grand Tetons and all that, so. Kind of a nostalgia trip for me. I was raised in it. Well, I wouldn't. All my people are up in that area, so. Not that I wanted to go see them. <laughs> <laughs> With its fish and relatives stink after about three days. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Isis. Okay. That's it for me. Well, I'm not sure. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I know I'm going to stay here for probably a couple more days, but after that, I'll probably head home. Um, I'm, I'm going to sit down and take a look at the maps today, and you know, I hate to make the same trip back home that I did last fall from here, and uh, you know, because I've already seen that stuff. Hey, so. you know, I was thinking you wanted to see Monument Valley, so you could go up that way and then take 70 all the way across down to. Catch 15 and go down to Vegas. Yeah, I may do that. Take a, like I said, I'll take a look at the maps today and and plan a route that's different than what I did last time. So 
anyway, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Okay. I'll keep in touch. Yeah, good idea. Sound like a plan? Yeah. Hopefully I can get my phone to work down there. Yeah. <laughs> Got one of those free phones. Yeah. You get what you pay for, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> it does not work out here at all. No phone. But, uh, well, shoot. You know, what did people do before they had phones? Smoke signals. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of smoke signals, Tell them about that uh, smoke signal we saw the other day. Oh, yeah, we had a fire, a pretty good fire going over here west of us. So. Uh, first noticed, you know, the, the planes flying in circles around and around and around. And pretty soon we hear the big tankers come into the helicopters. So didn't get big enough to, to rate as a wildfire, but uh, it put out some pretty good smoke. Yeah. It'll take them a couple hours, I guess, to put it out. Yeah. Oh, we looked so, on... Uh, on the web last night, and it turns out it was 11.2 acres. So it was, that's pretty good. I don't know how many acres they've got. It's got to burn before it, it gets upgraded to a you know, wildfire. But, but it was funny because we went over there to tell those people over there that, that you know, first we were telling them that everything's closed around here, hoping they'd leave. <laughs> and that's we went over there to tell them about the fire, you know, and was hoping they would leave, and they just. I didn't. <laughs> well, half of them did. Yeah. Yeah. Finally, they all left last night. Oh, and I'll tell you, it was so quiet last last night. Yep. I don't know. I didn't stay awake to see. Oh, I woke up several times. <laughs> yeah. That's all right. So anyway, it's nice and quiet and peaceful this morning. The birds singing and chipmunks chipping. Yep. <laughs> About three or four days of quiet, and then they'll start coming in to get curious. Yeah. You know, see what we're up or what we're up to. Yeah. Well, that robin that came over here yeah. a little while ago, looking to see what you were eating. Yeah. <laughs> just standing over there, ten feet, just standing there watching us. It's like Isis, standing yeah. there waiting for hers. Yeah. <coughs> she's funny, she'll see a spider run across the floor there. She doesn't bother, she just runs around trying to smell it, you know. <laughs> well, she gets aggressive with food. Yeah. I, we had chicken last night. Uh, thanks to John. I'll tell you, John is actually a very good cook. <laughs> Anyway, it was, it was, uh, what, what do they call those? Uh, rotisserie. Rotisserie. Rotisserie chicken, and uh, well, that's what we had for dinner last night, and gave Isis a few pieces of it, and she was, I thought she was going to claw through the screen door to go back in there and get some more. She kept running over and standing on the steps and looking in, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sniffing and sniffing. She definitely wanted some more, <clears throat> but yeah. she had enough. Yeah, she had enough. So I guess it's Ellen's vacation time and John's <laughs> healing time. Let's hope. So, Let's hope. Yeah. So John, Gavin, I, Gavin, I'm going to tell him about what Gavin oh, said. Oh, okay. okay. Gavin said that. Uh, uh, I don't remember exactly what he said, but you know, he said that Ellen is uh, uh, the lumberjack and and the waiter and the coffee bringer, and he had a whole list of things. and And then the last video I did showed him uh, showed Ellen getting water. So Gavin was saying that you know now he's uh, in charge of the waterworks department. <laughs> he said, "Dang, John, don't you do anything?" <laughs> He said something about Gunga Den. Now, what is a Gunga Den? Yeah, he said, what a Gunga Den. <laughs> what is that? I don't know, I know. I've heard of Gunga Den, but I didn't know it. Oh, he, he was, he's some famous butler. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> wow. What a legacy. John, it's fun. It's fun spending time up here with you, but doggone it. 
when you're in pain, yeah, it's yeah. no fun for you. No. And, you know, I don't mind at all waiting on you. Really? No, well, I'll I don't. take some bacon and eggs and hot cakes. Oh, okay. <laughs> right after this. Right. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I was just looking at me like, yeah, I'll take some too. Yeah. Say, I, I heard you guys talking about food. Yeah. You want some food? <laughs> I said, you want food? She gets that one ear and lays it back. The other one sticks <laughs> out straight. <laughs> uh, she's looking at her chops. She knows we're talking about food. Yeah. <laughs> this girl is a lover. <sighs> yes, she is. Yeah. Right on the nose. <laughs> yeah. Well, she missed. Oh. She missed. I'm getting pretty good at dodging her, too. Yeah. <laughs> well, John, you go home and get healed up, and you know, between now and then, we'll be thinking about what we're going to do and where we're going to go. I guess uh, Evanston's where we want to go. Yeah, we want to end up in Evanston, or I did. Yeah. It's how we get there that uh, that we got to work out. Yeah. And when. He's that as a base camp sort of, and then try to hit up the Grand Tetons and Jackson Hole and yeah. Ashley Forest, National Forest, and uh, Flaming Gorge. Just all up in that area right up in there yeah. within 100 miles of, all the way around. Shoot, we could make a long trip out of that. Yeah. Um. Uh, pretty nice. Like I said, I've I spent a lot of time up there, so. Yeah. It'll be nice. So y'all got something to look forward to. Yeah. Yeah, got something to look forward to. I'm looking forward to it. Oh, shoot, is there anybody that we should say hi to out there? Everybody. Everybody? Yeah. Okay. Got yeah. lots of viewers, so he does. Not me. Not me. Uh, uh, yeah. So those yeah, of I'll you. I'll try to keep up. I'll get a video once a week or something. I'll manage to uh, stay in contact with you some with you somehow, some way. Um, get that green screen back up. Yeah. You know? Yeah. At least I'll have a background rather than just a old wall. Yeah. So anyway, that's about all I got to say. I'm done. Okay. Y'all have a good day. Stay safe. See ya. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Next time. <laughs>